Donna Dalziel's husband, Don, suffers from frontal temple dementia. There is no cure for this rare condition, but the one thing that brightens his day is a trip to the sensory stimulation station at the Herb Bassett. Every day I bring him to the sensory station, and when I do that, I know he's going to have the best day that he can possibly have. The Herb Bassett home recently outfitted a room with light stimulation bubble tubes, fiber optic strands, and a picture projector. I would say it's almost like taking a child to Disneyland. Sensory stimulation has been proven to help people with Alzheimer's and other forms of dementia. It decreases agitation and restlessness and improves sleep. Staff and families say they see improvements in residents after spending time in the room. I find that if I bring some, a person in here, they will look around and you, you turn something on and say, and they'll put their eyes, focus their eyes on it, and they will just embrace it. Totally embrace it. And when I touch their, their arm, when they're being rigid, all of a sudden their arm goes down that they're relaxed. It means that they're enjoying it. You know, they're being stimulated. Residents are also using puzzles and toys to help improve their brain function. The people are anywhere from 30 to 75, 80 years old. Their mind is set is about of an 18-month-old baby. So we felt kid, the toys of kids' toys will stimulate them. Instead of using drugs to put them down, of course, they lose their legs, and then they fall, might, then they get pneumonia, and so forth. So we felt that using these toys will stimulate them a lot easier, faster, and least expensive. The room wouldn't have been possible if not for the fundraising efforts of the Prince Albert firefighters. They donated $15,000 for the room. I think it's a very worthy cause because I think we can all say that we know someone with an acquired brain injury or dementia or Alzheimer's or uh, some sort of a disease like that. So we're very, very proud to have our name on the, on the door of this uh, sensory room. Family members like Dalziel are grateful for the support. So they are helping all of Prince Albert and area because Within a few years, dementia and cognitive impairment is going to dwarf most other diseases. So we're all going to know of someone who needs this room, this facility. Around 40 residents are currently benefiting from the sensory stimulation room. There are plans to fundraise to purchase more equipment for active engagement at the Herb Bassett. For Shaw, I'm Lisa Rizm.